Hey everybody, I am here. I am early, but I am here. Uh, so I'm gonna go to my computer over there to make sure everything is set up. There is she. There she goes. So you can watch me while I'm doing that. I'll make sure that everything is on. Let's see what's going on. See, I guess I'm the only one watching, but it's okay. Uh, I want to make sure. Click on it. Hello. Let's see, click on it. Quiet, Perry. I see you. All right, perfect, perfect, perfect. Now hold on. Thank you for the thumbs up. I got to share this out. Just have patience with me. Uh, I create a post. Oops, let's see. Try and do what my daughter used to do. One. I don't know about Perry, guys. I don't know. Let's see what are we doing. Put it on my Facebook news. doing the best I can here. So here we are. I'm going to save it like that. Okay, guys, I'm here and it's definitely, oh my goodness, I got nine people on. Thank you. Thanks for coming. Thanks for giving me the, the thumbs up over there. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I can't tell from here, but thank you. I'm back. I'm here. <laughs> it is Sunday. Yo, wasn't it cold yesterday? Oh my goodness, it was chilly. It was really, who went to go outside yesterday? Wow, uh, I certainly did not. And even I turned the heat up. <laughs> I had my heat on like 73, which is a lot for me. I generally don't do that, but I had the heat on yesterday. It was cold. What about you guys? Where were you yesterday? How cold was it with you guys? Tell me. So. And while, we, while, while, while I can see some of the chats about that, uh, everybody, please give me a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs up. And um, uh, what I'm going to say here is I already got my Instant Pot going. Let me pull it down so you can see. That's my big girl right there. She my big girl. So, you know, I got her on because I want um, to make some chicken and noodles today. I figured, why not? Uh, oops. Woo. Sorry, guys. Sorry. No. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, my goodness. I don't know how I'm going to do this now because my thing just broke. How does this happen? Hmm. Oh, maybe I can put it back together. I don't even know how to do this. Hold, hold on, guys. I got technical 
difficulties right now. Uh, hold on. Let me see if I can figure out how to get this back on. Um, all right, guys. No, I'm going to have to get the other one out. So, hang out with me. Let me go find it. Let me find it. I'm going to have to get this one out, I think. Maybe not. Maybe I'll do this one. No, no. No, no. I'll take this one. I'm going to, I have to, cho I have to change this because for some reason, this thing broke off. So, let's see what we're going to do. Okay. That's better early than late. <laughs> Technical difficulties, man. <laughs> Technical technical difficulties all right i want to figure this out all right i put you on the other stand and i'll take you up oh, sorry here you go look at me okay i'm gonna pull it up higher which i could do okay got it got it got it got it okay i got the other stand yay <laughs> Yay, um, I got the other stand. Okay, it's a little bit better. I'm going to get rid of that one. I have another one. I guess, okay, I have another one. But anyway, here I am. And here is my pot. So we're going to be moving it around like that. So I'm going to take it down so you can see my pot. Okay, there goes my pot. And see, I've had this pot on here. And thank you guys who, who stuck with me <laughs> throughout this nonsense. Anyhow, I have my pot on. It's been on for, it's on for um, 30 minutes. And it already, it's already been on for 15 minutes. So I got another 15 minutes and, you know, so I got to wait on that anyway. So I figured I would get a jump start on, on this pot. Okay, good. I hear myself. All right. Better, I hope. Anyway, and thank you. Thank you guys at home that still hung out there with me on this situation. So anyhow, I got my pot on and it's been on for 16 minutes. I'm going to let it go down to zero. Then I'm going to let it do a quick release and uh, not a quick release. I'm going to let it, you know, sit around for like 15 minutes and then I'm going to a natural release. Then I'm going to finish it off and finish this, this, uh, this dish. I actually have this dish, um, this whole thing in um, my, uh, in, on my, in, on my channel that I did, I really did this like five years ago. And you know what? It's like, like I said, that day, it was one of those days that you want to just do that kind of thing. So I have it on my, my YouTube channel and I put, this is some frozen, I have frozen chicken thighs that I just, put in frozen because you can do that in your instant pot so I put some um some what does it call some chicken stock the first time I used better than bouillon but this time I had some of this in the pantry and this is unsalted right here it's unsalted so in fact it only has it has 50 grams of um sodium 50 milligrams of sodium and so I said you know what let me just do the unsalted, you know, because we got to watch what we eat, including me especially. <laughs> we got to watch what we, we eat. And so I put this container in here, and it calls for two cans. My original one was two cans of cream of chicken soup. And this is the healthy, it says the healthy request. Uh, I don't know how healthy it is. With It got 400 and literally it's got... Uh, in, in sodium, it's got 410 milligrams in this can, uh, per serving of this can. So I put just one can in because a lot of the time I put two cans in. But this time I'm going to just put one can in and I put that in. But I also put in some of my chicken, a teaspoon of my chicken better than bouillon. Just a teaspoon, even though, you know, just add a little more salt, but... I don't want to make it too bland. So I put a teaspoon of this in there 
with the uh, with the chicken broth. So I didn't, you know, that's some more salt. I'm sure that's coming in there. And what does this thing actually have? In sodium. So we talking a little bit of sodium today. Um, this is 510 milligrams of sodium in the teaspoon. So I'm, we talking we talking sodium today because um, you know I I'm I, it was a it was a, a little bit of a rough week for me for for my whole family because one of our members of my family is you know you know not doing well. I mean he's he, he's doing better, but you know. We in my family, we have heart issues. My mother died 71 from a heart attack and her whole family died like that. So we really have to watch out how we eat, what we're doing. And you know, if you guys see me from the beginning, I always try, 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 try to, you know, stay away from too much salt, you know, cause too much salt is not good for you, for your heart or, or anything. Too, too much, you, I personally, carry some salt, can carry water, because I'm on a water pill, you know, and I've been on a water pill for years, you know, at least. But, you know, it messes your heart up, it, it messes with your blood pressure, you know, and you just gotta, like, watch what you're doing, and you also gotta watch your, you know, what you're eating. And again, if you can cook at home, you can make your own food, it's so much better than eating out. It's just so much better. It's just really is because you know what you're eating. You know what you're putting in there. It's just a thousand times better. Even if you're doing, you know, frozen food from home, at least you know what, how much sodium or whatever, fat and everything else that you're putting in your food, that you're eating actually. But you really don't know how much you really eat unless you, um, you know, you track it and you know. So I'm because of the week I had. <laughs> I said, Stephanie, now we're gonna do this a little different. I'm still making the same recipe. A little different though. I'm just not gonna put as much sodium in it that I would maybe normally put in there, you know? So a little bit more, cause I've been, I could put a little more. She really used to tell me, oh my, it's too salty. <laughs> she could taste the salt. And I guess maybe, who knows, with COVID, I might've lost some of my taste bud too. So, you know, so I was like, you know what? Calm it down, calm it down. So anyway, there's frozen thighs in here that I just took straight from the freezer, put it straight in there. Hey, Joy. Hi, Pat. <laughs> uh, oh, my kid is around. Thank you, Sharita. <laughs> my child is around. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Push him out for me. <laughs> I can't, I can't. She's around. Yay. <laughs> so she's helping me out. So thank you. I can see that. Uh, so Sharita, there. Say hi to Sharita. Cause she's there. <laughs> Glad. Thank you. Cause this is hard to do by yourself. <laughs> it's, it's, it's good to have some help, you know? So anyway, yeah. So I, um, what was I saying? So yeah, this week was a lot of stuff happening, you know, a lot of, uh, um, things going on that was, uh, uh, <laughs> good. There she go. Hi, hi Pat. So yeah, a lot of, a lot of, uh, uh, different things was happening and, um, I'm like, uh, you know, even though I'm retired, I, I mean, I truly, truly love my family. I love my family, you know, and, uh, you know, then when things happen in New York, it disturbs me, you know, so <laughs> some of the things that's been going on disturbs me. So, um, uh, what did I actually do this week though? Uh, what was going on? Hmm. I, th I did a lot of editing. Uh, I did a lot of, definitely I did a lot of editing. I'm doing, you know. I'm, I'm trying this Amazon um, affiliates program where I'm going to, you put up, you, you do some some uh, review on certain things. I mean, I, heck, if, if Amazon sells this, I could do a review on this. And I, you know, I put it up, but it got rejected because I, and I kind of know why, because I got a lot of distracting things going on. So I'm going to redo it, take it down, redo it and send it out because that's something I can do and something I like to do. My God, I buy stuff from Amazon. I got stuff everywhere from Amazon. So it's just a matter of me learning, you know, more of um, to taking a picture of things and learning how, I, I, I'm even learning how to do a voiceover. I did a voiceover on some of my, on my coming up uh, videos. And I'm going to 
you know, I have some more videos that I just shot and I'm going to put those in on there too. I did a video this week of, of, uh, what's that called? Of, um, steak. Was it? It was stew, stew beef in my, uh, Ninja, in my Speedy. And it came out really good, but it was too much in that pot. So it kind of really, it really, uh, burnt up the top of my Ninja. So I had to steam it and then I had to clean it. Not only steam it, but I really had to scrub it down. So I actually, was, <laughs> while I was doing that, I was on camera. So I might, might throw that up there too, because this stuff happens when you use these machines. So, and you just have to like, know not to use over you, not to overfill some of the things sometime, which is why I actually use this pot rather than the little pot I have. I always use every, I always use that little pot, but I don't want it to overfill. I don't want it to, like, maybe I put too much stuff in there and I really don't want it to overfill. So I said, yeah, let me use my big pot. So I took my baby out, out of the garage and took her in and brought her, in, brought her back to work. So she's, she's good. I always, always love this one. And this is my newer one because, you know, it, you don't even have to press the button, turn the thing over to make it lock. This is a newer one. In fact, I might do a video on this one with a newer one. I may do that because I have one with my older one, older um, um, Instant Pot, but I think I might do one with a newer Instant Pot. And then of course I have the baby Instant Pot for other things. Matter of fact, that's just for, that's just for, um, what you call that? That's just called breakfast because I, I have my boiled eggs for breakfast. So that's what that's for. So yeah, it's been a couple of little things going on and I am busy with taxes. I've been doing taxes. Um, just busy, you know, and then, I don't know, it's like a lot of little things happening and I got to get myself on a schedule. <laughs> I got to really, really, really work on being on a schedule. This retirement thing to me, I love it, but I need to be on a schedule. So this week I actually decided to have, um, Echo wake me up every morning at nine o'clock but I don't get up at nine, but at least it wake me up so I can like get on a schedule. I might even start telling her to wake me up at eight so I can just stay on a schedule. I need to be on a schedule. I, I If I don't, you know, I'll just sleep. <laughs> and sleeping, it's not really, it's good. I, I mean, I'm sure I need, I need to be sleep. I'm sure I do. Let me see something. Uh, let me see. Hold on guys. I want to get in the middle. I want to actually push this. Oh, yeah, good. It works like that. Oh, cool. Uh, who knew? Good. I can move it that way. I can move it this way. This is one of my also Amazon buys that I bought. And I can move it all around. I just never really use it that way. But this works good. Pretty good. Okay. So, yeah. So, that's for me. Looking up, I'm looking too up at okay. That's that's much better. I don't have to look up at you guys. All right, so we got three minutes. Then we're gonna do on we're gonna be on um quick release. In the pot is the chicken, all my seasonings. Uh uh, I love your new home. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, I'm 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 really loving it too. <laughs> I'm really, really loving it too, especially in my office. My office is a mess, like my office. All my offices are, but that's where I get my stuff done <laughs> in my office. But I do really, really love it. I thank you so much. Um, but I got, uh, I used mostly garlic powder, onion powder. I used um, a no salt seasoning, uh, some of that. And for the salt part of it, I used, uh, I did put some salt in it. I put, um, the McCormick, the McCormick um, garlic, onion, and pepper thing. That's a, that thing, and I use a teaspoon of all that stuff <clears throat> into in in this in this pot with some onions, butter, and celery. And then once I'm once she finally lets me do the next step, I'm taking the chicken out. I'm gonna try to get the bones out. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm gonna try to get the bones out and then I'm gonna put the, all it back, all of it back in with some frozen peas and carrots. Uh, I may have some fresh peas or whatever. I'm gonna put some more vegetables in here with my 
bag of egg noodles. I got this. <coughs> Excuse me. This was part of, you know, it's in my pantry. And really, this is a pantry dish. This is what that I, it is. So, and we, we just, you know, that should work for us for tonight and a couple of nights. Because Perry likes this chicken and dumpling stuff. So he'll eat that. And then, you know, I guess, like I said, we'll have enough enough food for for a while. So, but once I once this thing, once, it, once the 15 minutes is up and I do a quick release and then I do my chicken, then it will only take another, hey, Bert, you hungry, huh? <laughs> I'm coming to your house. I'm coming to your house. Because <laughs> you're the cook, man. You're the cook. So, yeah, it will only take a little bit longer than after that because I'm only going to put it back on. On, on high pressure for like six more minutes just to get the noodles done because a pressure cooker is a beautiful thing beautiful thing and it gets stuff done like that it really is a beautiful thing if i got ribs uh i'm making chicken and dumplings today chicken and noodles today so and she beeping right now so i'm gonna let her do a little bit of a natural release here and i'm gonna take the top off and you guys can see that uh let me see. Let me see if I can get you down here to see my girl. See my pot. Yeah, that's my pot. Might need to put put you up higher. Let's see. Let's see. Huh? That's it. That's it. There you go. There she goes right there. There she is. Um, I see she's on zero already. And we're going to wait for her for a few more minutes. How much for a plate? <laughs> it's free. <laughs> no dollar amount. It's free. Come and get it. Come and get it. <laughs> Perry loves this stuff. So for him, for him, I'm making it. He likes it. And I could I like it too, but I can I could kind of do you know with it or without it. I wonder what I did with this. I wonder how I broke this. I broke this. See, that was the problem. I don't know what in the world, how it came off of here. I don't understand. Maybe I'm look. I'm talking to you guys, but I got no clue how to get it back on here. I gotta get Perry because he's the technical person. He's a technical guy. If he can get it back on here good. It might be salvageable. But I have like four of these things. And I'm, I'm new, you know, you know, I'm right here, I'm here. I'm, uh, here, oh, here we go. I gotta know to use this instead. Ah, can use that instead, okay. So I'm, I'm of course I'm new, uh, I'm new to messing around with all this equipment. So, <laughs> so I don't know how you put this together, but I know I got several more of these around here somewhere and I just gotta find them. But I got several more somewhere, probably in the basement. And believe it or not, I still got some um, more unpacking to do. I just kind of stopped. <laughs> I don't. I know. I guess everybody kind of does that. Once you once you get in your new place, you, know, you get stuff where you kind of want it, so that you could just stop unpacking. That's what people do. So I have more things. To, even my closet, my bedroom closet. I have to unpack the bedroom closet. But it's winter. And so I'm like, well, I don't want to put stuff in a drawer for summer. The struggle is real. Yeah, I'm telling you. <laughs> I'm telling you. Like, I, don't, I want to put it, I want to put it um, somewhere, but I'm like, I'm going to leave it where it is right now and see what I even like or what I'm going to use. And, you know, I'm going to just muddle through it and, and find out. I got, a, I got a place to put some of my stuff I had in my china closet, which the stuff is downstairs. Um, I, I will eventually get up, get that from downstairs and then put them away. And some of my other stuff, I got places to put it now, but I just haven't had, I just didn't go and do that. So with me getting up at like nine o'clock, maybe if I tell it to wake me up at eight, I might get up at nine. <laughs> with me trying to do that, then I think maybe I will, uh, you know, eventually take some of that time and get some of these other things done. But I guess... I'm just tired. <laughs> I guess I'm just tired, man. It was, best 2022 was hard <laughs> on me. It was hard. I was trying to, to get the house 
I was trying to get finished, like with my trying to work, and we worked. Believe me, you know, we 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 worked. It was a, uh, it was it was rough. And then, and then, um, then I'm trying to move and trying to pack and trying to still do a little YouTube. <laughs> It was hard. It, it, it was hard. It, it was hard. And I think I'm just like, okay, let me take a break. But I, I need to, I promise that I'm going to be showing up for you guys. Except next week, I'm not going to show up because next week is the Super Bowl, which I used to call the Stupid Bowl. Because you can <laughs> tell you right now that I don't care about no Stupid Bowl or football. <laughs> Why not? Because it's the Stupid Bowl. Burp. <laughs> it's the stupid bowl. The stupid bowl is going to be on. Everybody's going to be watching it. So I figured, you know what? I'm going to take a break next week. That's why I'm not coming. <laughs> I took a break. I'm going to take a break because it's Super Bowl week. Green Bay all day. You know what? That's what my brothers used to, uh, they used to like Green Bay. Green Bay Packers. They was like rooting for them. So maybe I'll root for them too because uh, my brothers used to root for Green Bay all the time. And since the New York is not in it, they got themselves out of it a few weeks ago. So, got a roof for somebody, but I am not watching it. But I can't think you guys, you people watch it for the for the commercials, right? That's what it is. Y'all like the commercials. So, cuz they got some of the best commercials on 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 the football game. Uh, so, I think everyone's going to watch it for that. But uh, I'm not doing it. But I might make some sliders that day. <laughs> I may make some sliders for me. Halftime, yeah, yeah. Everybody likes that halftime thing, Bert. You know, so I guess they'll they'll be liking that. But I might make me some sliders that day. That's what we may, we may have. Me and Perry, or I might have company too. Hennessy wings, yeah, yep. <laughs> That's good. Oh, you know what? I went to a store out here that sold um, Tennessee. Uh, what is it called? Tennessee sharp cheese or something? Let me get it out the refrigerator. Oh, here it goes. Yeah. This stuff, it's, it's, I didn't actually go, but my neighbor told me about it. So I looked at it and, you know, I got some online. I don't think you can see it because of the light. Okay, that's a little, little, I found a place. It's called Tennessee. There we go. Uh, this way. It's called Tennessee Whiskey Cheese. Um, it says spirited and smooth. It is delicious. It is really good. So I bought these because she, she had some. We went to somewhere. We went to someone else's house, and she had brought it there. And boy, was it good. I said, this is really tasty. So I bought some cheese, full of salt, but I still bought it. And I like that when you said um, the Hennessy, uh, Hennessy wings, that made me think about this cheese. And I bet you that cheese, those wings and this cheese would be great together, especially since it's, you know, a Super Bowl. So, you know, you got family, you got people, friends over, playing, watching the game. I think here um, at the clubhouse, they're gonna have like a Super Bowl party to watch the game or whatever they are doing over there. So, you know, when that kind of thing, you need to have some food that people wanna eat and, you know, and have a good time. But if it was New York, Giants or the Jets, I'd be watching. <laughs> I, it's about the only time I might watch some football. <laughs> Giants of the Jets. The last time I had a party in my house, I think, was probably the last time they were in it, which was so many years ago. And they were at my house, and they won. They won. It was before Sandy, so they won. I was like, wow, we, we had a great time. But that's when, you know, the party's at my house. <laughs> but the party's not at my house this year, and I think maybe my brother may come over here anyway next week. So if he's coming, then, you know, for sure, I'm not doing YouTube for next week. But I'll be back. And, you know, I'm on number 99. I'm 99 right now. That's pretty good. 99 times I was on on a Sunday. How about that? 99 times. Wow. So, you know. So, guys, y'all tell me what's going on with you. Let me know what's going on with you. So take, I'm going to take you down here. I'm going to take you actually down a little bit lower so you can see my pot. How many minutes? We want eight minutes. You know what? I'm going to do, do a quick release right now. 
I was saying 15 minutes, but I'm going to do a quick release right now. And in this pot, uh, you can see, in this pot, see right here? I'm getting home from work. Oh, working on Sundays, Bert. Oh, but I know you got to. I mean, everybody got to eat. So then we open this up and vent it. Just press that. That's, I, this is what I love about this pot. Yo, I love that about this pot. This pot, you don't got to fumble with it and think you're going to burn yourself. It just, it does that. It does that. It works well. It's so much better than the older pot. So, if you were looking for an instant pot, the new ones are so much better than the older ones. You know, they're so much better. You ain't fumbling around with this thing. And it just is the, look at that. It just, the steam comes out. It's almost done. And it smells delicious. <laughs> that thing just popped up. <laughs> you and me, we got to figure this out. You, we got to figure that out. But it's old. That veneer is old. I had it for a year, for years. So it's time for me to find my other one and stop this nonsense. Perry keeps saying, stop the nonsense. So I think I had this ever since I began doing lives, um, which was at least four, four years ago or so, you know, because my nephew was helping me then. So God, so what's going on? What is going on? I'm just running my mouth. I don't know what's going on. No one's saying anything to me. Let me know. As a matter of fact, I, I lied. I lied. Well, Bert's been talking to me. Yes, Bert's been talking to me. So, so that's cool. So, so tell me, what's, what did you do yesterday? How cold was it? Bert, how cold was it yesterday? How cold was that? Let me open it. Love it, love it, love it. Ooh, get that out. I'm going to, I'm going to let you see what's in the pot. Oh, it smells good. Yeah, I said. I'm going to let you guys see what's in the pot, but I'm taking it out of the pot. See? That's what the pot looks like. Um, 10 below zero. Oh, I believe that. <laughs> Woo! How much? Well, so, so what's the temperature today? Because it's like 50 degrees out here. So what's the temperature today, Bert? All right. You're going to watch me do what I got to do here with this chicken. So I'm gonna try to get you in a better spot so you can see. Let me move her, move her over here. I have to figure out. I have to do better. I gotta do better with how I edit and how I do this thing myself. Forty-seven. Yeah, isn't that crazy? I stayed in all day. It was stupid cold. <laughs> I know. I I did the same thing. I stayed right home all day. Let's see. Let me get you in here. Let me get you in here. Let's see. This winter is crazy. That's true. That's correct. That's true. Man, I wish that my overhead was working. So I know you can see what I'm doing. But, and I can't do it with one hand, maybe. But at least I'm going to take it out of here with one hand. Will you take it out with one hand? Come on, chicken. Come on out. Yeah, I can take it out with one hand. There we go. Put her over here. You see the chicken? And then, let's see, do I have another one? Yep, I do. Yep, I do. Now, watch, watch me try to work this with one hand. I'm gonna shred it. Got my fork. I'm gonna shred it right here. Let's see how I can do that. Get it all shredded and get that bone out of here. Yeah. There we go. Here we go. Now, this was totally, totally frozen. And to be honest with you, it could. It's still, see? Look look what it looks like. So I need to put it back in longer anyway. Yeah, because it's still, it still could have, It's I, I'm supposed to wait for the 15 minutes, which I did not do. So that's what I get, because I didn't do that. And, okay. Let's see how I can let's see how I can angle this so y'all can see what I'm doing. I need I need Perry right now. I need Mr. Perry right now. Oh, that's too much. No, nope, let's go here. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Can you see? I think you can. How about that? 
I think I'm getting it here. Let me get a little closer. Okay. How long do you cook the chicken? It was totally frozen. I put it in here for 30 minutes, Joy. 30 minutes. So, it's not totally done, but it's almost done. And with that, it's good enough right now. So, I'll just put it back in and let it finish off. I'm going to do it like this. Come on down. Here we go. So a little bit, it still could use a few more minutes, but this water is hot, it'll be fine. Cause I'm putting it right back in and putting it right back on pressure. So it should be fine. It should be just fine. Okay. Come over here too. Get this off the bone. That's my, my concern is to get it off the bone. Take the bone off. I don't know how many pieces of uh probably about four pieces of um of thighs right here it's probably about four and come on get off of there get off of there get off but this was frozen guys frozen 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 right from the freezer frozen i took it right out the freezer and put it right in the pot so that was really, really, really frozen. Okay, okay. Just because I, feel like I need to get a, something to throw that out in. Get a paper plate. I can throw these bones out. Come on, bone. Say bye bye. Say bye bye. Say bye bye. Come on. Let's go. Put you right there. That's all I need. So we're gonna put it in. This will be fine though. They're nearly done. It's nearly done. It's in that hot water and it'll be fine. I got my skin on here. Do I, need my, do I want my skin? I don't really need my skin. I'll take the skin off. Skin off. Skin is good though. That skin is good. Make this, this, this whole broth so much better. So, in she go. You go over here for a sec. Put this one in. Put it back in here, back in the pot, and continue to cook. Continue to cook for me. Let me take this one out. Let's take her out. I think there's one more. There's one more in here. Come on. Where you at? There's one more. Oh, you guys can see me good, I think. Good. Very good. All right, so... Let's do you, see what's, let's see what's happening with you. I feel a bone. Where you at, bone? I feel you. Oh, there you go. I see you now. There you go, bone. Coming out. Let me take the skin off of here. Come on, skin. This is why I started this early, because we be here forever. And you know, we don't have forever, do we? <laughs> we don't have forever. Uh, we're going to do it like this. And what we got? What we got? So my kid. So, Sharita, you out there? Sharita, are you there? I know she's coming home from work and stuff. So, I didn't really bother her. Or if, if it ain't her, it must be Tiff. Tiffany, are you there? One of you guys are there. I know. I know one of y'all are there. <laughs> I know whether you guys are here. That's my girls. Both of them, they my girls. One is my, one is my real girl, and one is the one I took over. She's been my girl since, since she made her, her, her sister. So she's my girl. <laughs> and anyway, they go in here. So tax season has started, guys. So you guys get your taxes done yet? You know... You're not going to, most, a lot of people, depending on your situation, I shouldn't say everyone, but depending on your situation, you're not going to get the money you got back last year in a couple of years because of COVID, because they gave you a lot of extra stuff because it was COVID. And now, you know, a lot of people are on unemployment or whatever they were doing. And those people, you know, even when they were on unemployment, some of the unemployment money was taxable. And now, if you are on unemployment, none of it is taxable. 
So you got like a break. It was a much better break that people were getting um, recently, but not no more. Not no more. It's not happening like that no more. So yeah, this will be fine. Go in that dog on hot water and it's on high. The sucker's gonna be way done. That's the that's the beauty of the pressure cooker. The absolute beauty of it. And um, last time I made them, well, in my video that I made them with, um, I did them um, with, um, I did just breasts, frozen breasts. But these are, and then they have no bones in them. But these have bones, and the bones definitely make the flavor, guys. Don't let, don't, don't be fooled. The bones help with the flavor. So if you want some flavor, have a bone in it, man, in my opinion. Do it with a bone. The flavor is magnificent. All right. In she go. In she goes. In she goes. In she goes. In she goes. Okay, my celery's even coming out. It smells good. It smells delicious. And then the last one. Come here, baby. I see the bone. I see the bone. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. So everybody, I'm sure, is going to have a great time watching that. Yes, um, football game. And the next kind of game you guys are going to want to watch is the basketball game. That's Perry's game. That is Perry's game. This knife could be sharper, too. The knife could be sharper. That would make much more sense. But, yeah, the next, guy, the next game you guys are going to watch is that. And meanwhile, I am going to, to just um, keep trying to work on my YouTube channel. And, you know, do the other things I need to do uh, around this house. Um, tomorrow, I may go to, um, to Costco, the one that's out here. I might go out here to Costco out here, which is a big, like, it's a big um, mall out there. It's about, probably about an hour away. But I might go there because I'm looking for a table. And, you know, I want to get that. And I know they have it, they have it at the Costco in my in New York, so I'm hoping that they have it at this one out here, and I'm just going out there. Plus, I got some Costco bucks to spend from last year, so I got a, some money to spend out there, which is free, not free, but because it definitely ain't free, because <laughs> I definitely used it. So I still can go out there, and I might go out there. And then I might stop at the Apple Store, because I'm thinking I want to get me a new a new um, eye touch. That's what I want. I want to get me the eye touch. That's what I'm thinking. I want to get. All right, that's all the chicken. I don't believe there's anything else in there. Let let me just make sure, but I'm pretty sure that there's no. I think it only had four in the pack. So I'll stir it. Take you up to stir it. Look, I'm stirring it. There's nothing else in this pot. Doesn't that look like some good old chicken, chicken and noodle soup, man? That's what I'm on, basically what I'm doing right here. Don't that look good? I'm telling you, I'm telling you, I'm telling you. All right, so not only do I need that, I also need some peas and carrots. I need my bag of peas and carrots. She's going in. She's going in right now. The whole bag, frozen peas and carrots. Here we go. This is a dump and go kind of dish, I'll tell you right now. And when, like I said in the first video, I ain't got time to be sitting around here cooking a bunch of stuff all the time. So then my peas and carrots are in here. I may put some, I have but I'm, I'm, I'm not. I'm gonna leave it like that. I'm, gonna, I'm stopping right here. We stopping right here. Except that I'm going to put in these noodles. Then in they go. In they go. In they go. The whole thing. Bye bye. Bye bye. You was in the pantry, so I'm, I'm saying goodbye. And I make sure that I use my pantry items up. I don't think, I think that we kind of good right here. So, let's look back over here. Come this way, girl. Come this way. There she goes. And 
She's been keeping warm for 23 minutes. Well, let's turn her off. And cancel is right here. So we turn her off. Right there. Go back and get the top. Here's the top. I'll tell you, when you first be trying to put this on, it's like, how the hell are you staying on? <laughs> but anyway, this way is open toward this way. You see the arrow? This toward this way here is open. And that way is closed. And you hear the little noise, the little music. We're going to go back on pressure cook, right? In this instance, it says custom. I'm pressing custom. I'm not doing 30 minutes. We're going to turn it down to six minutes. Now, you know what? I'm going to do a little longer. I probably don't have to, though. I think maybe seven minutes. Be nice. Be nice and put it on seven minutes. Seven minutes, press start, and then press start. Press it to make it on high, then press start. So here she go. She's on preheat. She's preheating. So she got to come back up to temperature. And she's on number two already because it's already hot. So she's going to come up to temperature. And when she gets to temperature, it's going to come on to this side right here where it's cooking for six minutes. And then it should be done. And we have done our video at that point. So let me get back up and talk to you guys. I'm learning how to use this bad boy. Okay. Okay. How come you don't want to go higher? Hold up. Oh, that's because it's over here. That's why you won't go higher. Okay. Put that one down. Put this one up. Hmm, how come you don't go higher? All right. Guys, forgive me. Forgive me. I don't know why she's not higher. Hold up. Oops. <laughs> You, know, uh, you people think I'm crazy. <laughs> Y'all think I'm crazy. Hold up. Let me look at me. You can look at me like this. But why ain't she going higher? Let's see. I know she will. It's, it's a, I think this is five feet. And I know you're not tall as I am at this point. Girl. Let's see. Will you go higher? No, you seem like you won't. Ah. Yes, she will. Maybe you won't. Maybe you won't. Well, high as you go. Whoop. <laughs> uh, anyhow, here we are. Here we are. And I don't really know why. You don't go higher than that. Huh. Anyway, you see me now. I'm going to be playing around with this, this thing. And that's how we're going to do it. So, while this is on, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to move you all over. Because at least I could do that. I'm going to move you over to my table. And talk to you like that so I can actually see you. That's what I'm going to do. Move you down. I can come down and I could talk to you a little bit. All right. Here I go. So, now while that's, that's on, tell me. I'm, I'm running, 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 running my mouth. But what's going on? How's everybody? It's Sunday. It's warmer today. Uh, you know, I, I ain't got nothing. Well, I, I don't have anything to, to, to um, complain about at all. I mean, you truthfully, I'm really blessed. <laughs> I don't every day I'd be like, wow, I'm really, really, really blessed. I don't really have. You know, I have no complaints. Everything is everything is good on my end. You know, my daughter's working. She's doing, uh, you know, trying to do her job and other things. And they're trying to get the house together to make it pretty for them, make it nice for them. And I'll be, I, I'll be back to see them. So, yeah, everything is everything is is pretty good. Um, this was the first, this was the end of January, beginning of February, right? So. My, my niece's birthday was Wednesday. I think it was Wednesday. The first, that was Wednesday. My nephew's birthday was on Thursday. So happy birthday to you guys. Happy, happy birthday. It is, uh, it is Aquarius season. Hey, 70 Roger, how you doing? How are you? I'm glad you're in the house. <laughs> I'm glad you're checking in. So yeah, but 
I'm sitting here waiting for my, my chicken and noodles to uh, be done. And then that's dinner. And that's it. So I told Perry I, this morning, I said, you know what? Because we'll eat eggs, sausage every day and cheese almost every day. Or we'll eat eggs and bacon almost every day, or which is more depth. Sometimes it's scramble. Sometimes I do boiled eggs, you know, but we eat that nearly every day. And I said, I got to go away from that a little bit. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna try, I, I, I like cereal. How, how many people like cereal? Cause I like like maple. That's what I like. I like maple cereal. That's what I like, or oatmeal. And I'll hook my oatmeal up, which is probably what I'm gonna do. I hook that oatmeal up. I make put some um, some some vanilla and some almond and maple flavoring in it, and let it cook. Mm, 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 mm. Delicious. I love oatmeal like that. I can eat oatmeal. I probably I can probably do that. I mean, even in my even in my smaller my smaller um, um, instant pot, I could probably do that. But then I can do that and make a boiled egg with it or something. So I'm not doing so much processed food. I mean, I don't want to do too much, too much processed food. I'm trying to, because that stuff just got too much salt in it. It's already processed. Just, it's just so much better to do it yourself. And, you know, if you can, do it yourself. But, I, you, know, you know what? People don't have time, you know. Cereal is good, but I like grits, cream of wheat, and oatmeal. I like cream of wheat, too. And I like oatmeal if I hook it up, if I hook it up. And I'll eat some grits with my egg. I just can't have grits without the eggs. I I need some I need some a scrambled egg with that and I'll and I'll eat that. Um but then I feel like I need a piece of, of meat. <laughs> I need a piece of bacon. I need a piece of sausage. Do you feel like that? I need I need a piece of bacon or sausage or something with my breakfast in the morning. I need some other kind of meat. And you know, you 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 really I mean oatmeal is really good for you. It's good for your heart, it's good for you, period. Um but you need some protein in the morning to help you, you know, to help you get through the day. You really do need some protein, you know. So this is why I usually do have um, some, an egg. I have an egg every day. You know eggs are ridiculously high. But I still usually have an egg, one egg. Perhaps what I do is cut it down and have, I have, we have three boiled eggs each. That's what I usually do, three boiled eggs each. I'm going to cut it down even when I'm doing that. I'm gonna cut it down to less. So we don't, at least if I'm eating it, we won't eat as much. And then we go outside, cause we, we both getting, we both eating. <laughs> we both eating. And then I, I go to, then I be thinking that I'm in a store or something, or I'm looking online to buy something. And I be thinking about Twizzlers, man. <laughs> I, be, I be thinking about Twizzlers, about ice cream, you know, just like, you know, because I think, because right now, I refuse to buy eggs with that price. Yeah, I know. It's hard. It's hard, but we eat them every day. Or I use them in something else. So I, you know, we eat, and I'm telling you, we eat three eggs a day. So I may cut it down to two eggs for us. That's it. I'm going to cut it down a little bit. I think that's what I'm going to do, too. Just cut down as, as much as we've been eating. But because it feels, for me, I don't know. Remember when? Remember when we had COVID and, like, everybody just went home and it was like, okay, you with your family now. And it's like, it was like a holiday, you know? You was having, you know, okay, let's have, let's, you know, I know we working, but let's have, you know, let's have some French toast, you know, and let's eat this and let's eat that. And it felt, and, and, and then frankly, because we all felt like that, everybody was running to the food store and that, you know, it was a run on, on toilet paper and paper towels and all, everybody was running to get everything and just to make sure you like got it. It's like it was a snowstorm and you not ever, ever, ever gonna get anything anymore. And that's what, that's what it feels like in a sense here because you know, it's new to me, you know, and I'm relaxing and you know, I like to eat. I'm not gonna lie, I like to eat, you know? So, you know, I'm like, hmm, I've been thinking about, like I said, Twizzlers, I ain't supposed to eat them things, come on. <laughs> I'm not supposed to eat those things, but I did buy. I tell you, that's another thing I could talk. I could talk about. I bought. I think it's called Country Kitchen, something like that is the name of that place. Um, but I bought like um, beans, coffee beans, and I did a little video on it, which I'll have out later um, about that little haul that I, I got. But I bought some um, beans that go into my um, 
Keurig back there. That's not a Keurig. That's my Cuisinart. A Cuisinart single grinding brew. That's what it is. And I've been, I've been, I've been enjoying my coffee. Like, man. So they had this one called um, Carmel, Carmel and Cream. Sweet Carmel or something like that. Boy, is that good. Oh, it's a good coffee. And I, when I grind my beans up, that is so delicious. It's like, <sighs> now, you don't have to put no sugar in it or, you know, I always put cream in it. So I always do um, some coffee made or something. That's how I like my coffee. But it is so good. It's like, ah. Uh... <laughs> that's how I'm feeling. I'm telling you, that's how I'm feeling lately. I just feel like, <sighs> Like, I don't have all that stuff that was going on <laughs> around me, you know. And it's like, ah. Uh... You know, you really got to get away from stress. Things that stress you, man, get the hell away from it. Get the hell away from them stressful things because it'll kill you. Mm, you know, we're going to all die when we're supposed to die. But before you die, you're going to be stressed out and almost dead anyway. Get away from the stressful thing. Get away from things that stress you. Leave it. Go somewhere else and do something else because there really is a lot more things to do. You know, as soon as you, as soon as you clear your mind, you be like, "Oh, I can do that. Oh, I can try that." And I'm like, "Why not go try it?" <laughs> and it's like, mm. <sighs> that 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 struggle for that paycheck. <laughs> I struggle for that paycheck and keeping up with keeping the wheels going, and you know, and still keeping everything going and running and running and running, especially in New York. Oh, it's just you just running and running. Why they got to go to work? And I don't know. You know, I do know, but I I think it's so unfair to the people that got to do it. You know, it, it just it just really, ugh, I'm so happy about not being there. Oh, I can't even tell you. I'm so happy about not being there, not being, not doing that. Oh yeah, and a friend of mine who um worked in she worked in my building, and she worked in the other like across the hall from me, but a different company. Uh, she came by. She came through. Um, because she was going to Maryland, so she stopped by, and you know, we we spent um, Thursday together. I cook all day, and that distressed me. Oh, good, good. That can do it, cause when you you know you like to cook, that's like I'm making this for me. But just as long as you don't overdo it, like I'm thinking right now about some cinnamon rolls. <laughs> I'm thinking about. I'm thinking about some cinnamon rolls and a cup of coffee. Ooh, wee, would that be perfect? So I know I can make that, but I am not going there. <laughs> and if you have other people that can eat it, that's perfectly fine. But it's just like with, with me and just me and Perry, and I don't really, I don't want to, I can give it to my neighbors. But, you know, we all in the same boat. We can't eat all that food. We can't eat that kind of food, you know. So I got to be mindful of not only just us, but other people who can't really eat all that food. So I can't do it. Yum. Yes, I saw the video. Oh, man, were those all those things good? And I made them twice or maybe three times. Oh, it's like, I can't, we can't do that. Perry's like, I can't. I can't. <laughs> I can't eat them. But they were so good. And we ate them up. Like, you know, we I, the next day we had at least me. I had some with my, after I ate my breakfast, then I had some with my coffee. And, 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 and like, no, 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 we can't do this. We can't do this. And and I would like to go outside. I do go outside some and walk. But you never know what kind of day it's going to be. Like let, yesterday, nobody was trying to go outside and walk. It was, I don't know, zero degrees outside and windy and stuff. You can't go outside like that if you can't plan to go outside. Today it was 50 degrees, but... I had planned to do some, of course, what I'm doing right now, but I, if, you know, I, I probably, and maybe going forward, and if it's raining, we don't go outside. It seems to rain a lot here. I don't know. Maybe it rains everywhere, but it seems to just rain a lot out here, you know? So I, I have to like really kind of plan, okay, I'm getting up, I'm going out, I'm going to walk. I got to get it, like, I got to get it to, 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 together because I'm still half in New York. In my brain and half here, you know, and certain things I want, I knew I can get it in New York and I'm looking for it and, you know, I can't find it and all that kind of stuff. But, you know, for me, I, I, I have to get 
like centered, you know, because <laughs> I still feel all over the place. I, I, I do. I really, I still feel like I'm all over the place because, again, I can't, some of my stuff I know I have, I can't find it because it's somewhere in this house, probably downstairs. I just haven't opened it up and I've been so used to just getting what I want. You know, I know where it was and just go get it. But now it's like, okay, I know I have it. Where is it? Where is it? You know, <laughs> it's, real, it's real, real, real deep, you know. My printer, I just changed the tone on my printer because I have a, a, a new printer. Well, it's new. It's really, it's, it's the same printer I had before, but it's just, uh, I got another one. And the, the toner in there, of course, is new. But you know when you buy those printers, those things don't have... They only have a tiny bit of toner in it. So it already started saying that I need more toner, you know, if the toner is low. So, but I always buy the off-brand kind of toner. And for me, I mean, and it lasts okay because it's the price is wonderful for it. But the color doesn't come out. It's just not as dark as if you bought the toner that really goes with the machine. So, you know, I'm noticing that and I'm like, but do I want to get it? I mean, if you shake it up, if you get a new new toner, that's for the brand of, of your of your printer, it lasts a lot longer anyway, but it costs more, a lot of money. So even though you might get four of the off-brand ones, maybe you want to just get the right one and put that in your machine in the first place and it would last, it would look better and last longer. But I don't know. So, so right now I'm, I'm, I'm looking at that. I'm looking at my, my toner and all this other kind of stuff. I'm like doing all kinds of things today. Um, after I'm finished, I'm gonna go back. Um, I gotta probably do some video, some editing and stuff. I work on that after I'm finished with this and after we eat, I'm gonna do something else, you know, like that. Now, now, let me see. I think I got maybe three more minutes and I might, might not even have three more minutes. Let me see if it's on walk. Let's go back. Let's take a walk. Let's take a walk. Let me see. Let me see. Oh, yeah, it's still cooking. It's got three minutes. It's three more minutes on high. So after that, then I'll take it out. And we got dinner done. And if I didn't start this video before you guys came on, we'd be here for another hour. <laughs> and I didn't think you guys want to hang out like that for a whole other hour. You know, hey, Shirley, I'm doing good. I'm hanging in. How are you? How are you? I'm, I'm doing good. I really am. I am blessed. I am so blessed. So, so blessed. You know, again, uh, it, was, it was things happening at home is happening, and I'm stressed. They, you know, just knowing it because I love them all. I love my family, and stuff is happening, and I'm like, oh, man. <laughs> you know, oh, man, oh, man. So, you know, even... Somebody I know, her, well, my girlfriend who passed away, her dad just died, you know, and, and it's, you know, I mean, I guess if I could be there, I'd be there. You're good, good, Shirley, good, good. But I hear all my, oh, I hear all my, the information from home and it's not usually good, you know, so it's like kind of depresses me, you know what I'm saying? I want to hear good things. So somebody tell me something good. Tell me something good. <laughs> Tell me that to like it. Tell me something good. You know, that's the, I, I, I like to hear good things, you know, because I think, I, I think sometimes, you know, we concentrate on the bad side when there's some good side to everything that's bad, really and truly it is. Like, if, you know, you spin it around and you get a positive side of it, you know, it's just, it's just so much better off for everybody. So, like, every time you think of something that's not really good, think of the, the, the think of the, or not good for you, maybe, there, there's something positive about it, you know. Ah, oh, thank you very much. Thank you. I, I like, I kind of like this mess. <laughs> it's so, it's so easy to take care of, too. You don't do anything to it. <laughs> After it's in, you know, I got to show you something. I'm going to take it, I'm going to take it down. My, my thing just beat, so that means it's ready. I'm going to take it down. And this is what it looks like without this. I wear this because this thing, this thing here. I wear it because it, um, my hair is in my face. And I, it's, I can't, like, if I'm looking down, I can't see nothing. I don't particularly like that. But the hair, it's really, it really is, it's really good for me, you know. You have to do hardly nothing. 
And my own hair under here is gray. Uh, it's getting grayer. Because <laughs> you, can, you can see right now that the gray is starting to pop back out. But, you know, it's, it's, it's healthy under there. It's really, it, it, the perm is just about out of there, I think. And, uh, you know, it's my hair, my own hair is growing. It's natural now under there. Um, I think I'm going to try to, like, twist it. I'm going to do that um, whenever I take this out. I may give that a try. So my hair, so my own hair could be out for a little while. Then I'll probably stick these back in to, to protect my hair. But every once in a while, you got to have let your own hair out. But the perm was in my hair for, my God, probably 30 years, you know, one way or another. That perm been in my hair about 30 years. Definitely. 25 to 30 years. Because I know when I moved in my old house. Yeah, it's more, yeah 27. At least 25 years it's been a perm in my hair of some sort. So I want to get my hair a rest from a perm and, and from all the other stuff you got to do to it. And this stuff really, if you, if you want to give your hair a rest, this is a good way to do it. Just give it a rest. Put this in. Like they cornrow it and they stick it in. I could actually even do it myself, except my arm would, my hand would really kill me. Because if I take it out, my arm is still, my arm is still not great. <laughs> but when I'm taking it out, I get pain in my arm. So I let somebody else do it. But yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm loving that. So then you just stick this like rubber band thing on your head, and that gets it, that gets that hair out of my face, and I'm cool with that. You know, <laughs> I'm cool. This is the life. You know, I'm a black woman. And in corporate America, you know, when I was coming up, you couldn't wear this. And you could not go to work with this. You couldn't do it. They, they don't want your hair. You couldn't have all, you couldn't have your natural hair. They was upset about that. You couldn't have, you know, a wrap I put on my hair, which I love. I still put that on my head because I, why? Why not? You couldn't wear wraps. You couldn't really, they didn't love your afro. You know, you had to have your hair perm and straight and all that. But to be, to make some money, you did it. You know, you did it. Because you 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 trying to get in to get the work done. I, I know I could do the job. But because I look a certain way, you know, they didn't want to hear that. So, you know, it, I'm, I'm really glad to know these days that these young people are wearing their hair or their wig, or their whatever they wear on their head, or even even putting, you know, uh, um, what do they call that? The habar? The, when they cover their hair, they doing that. And I'm really, really glad to know that they are doing that. I'm really, really glad to know that they're doing that. I have to get closer to um, the end because my battery is getting low. But I'm going to plug it up, but it's still getting low. I'm plugging her back up. And we're getting ready to finish this off. So, okay, that's good. Uh, get, let me get a plug. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Get that plug over here. Excuse me again. Okay, let me plug her up. There. She don't like that. She's like, huh, what are you doing? What are you doing? All right. All right, Ashley, let me keep her down here so you can see what I'm doing. There she go. Okay, so she is now on keep warm. She went, then went through the whole cooking process. She's on keep warm for four minutes, which is good. Perfect. So it's not only, and that also means that it's doing a natural release. So I'm going to finish this off. I'm going to turn it on. See, I know you can see that steam. I can see that steam. <laughs> and all the steam is coming out of here. That's dinner, girl. That's dinner. That's dinner right there. I'm done. What time is it? Like five? Almost six o'clock. I'm done. Time to eat. Time to eat. The, to, this morning, all I had was coffee. And some English muffins, which wasn't really this morning. It was about 12 o'clock. So it's about time to really get some protein in me <laughs> of some sort. And it's not too late. Because guys, you can't eat too late and then go to bed. That is not good for you. So I got to do better. I'm going to do better. 
for all kinds of reasons. I got to get on a schedule. And even just to see you guys on Sundays is a schedule for me. <laughs> I got to get on a schedule and get stuff done. And while I, while I do people's taxes, I got to wait for them to, you know, for their information and, and things like that. And them to look over stuff and what whatever. So it's like I got time to play around while I'm waiting for that. And that's still not like structured, you know. But I know that's what I'm going to do all day. So that's what happens. That's what it is. And she almost done. But she's getting quiet. I don't hear her so much. You see the smoke, though, though. You see that smoke? This is a great machine. This is a great machine. Don't forget about your Instant Pots. You know I be using my ninjas, but don't forget about your Instant Pots. Do not. Do not. And when I was in the freezer, I saw some uh, turkey wings. Hey, kid. How you doing? She's in. She's in. Good, good, good. She's in. <laughs> so how are you doing, young lady? How you doing, Sharita? All right. Let me open it. Nope, can't open it. It won't let you open it until it until that thing goes down. I'm okay. I work today. But how is how is the kids today? How is work today with those kids? Uh almost. Yep, it went down. Now I can open it. Get that, get that steam out of there. I know I'm doing something wrong, but because that thing goes up higher. But I'll find out. I'll figure it out. Okay, I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to take a look. Take a look in the pot. Look at the pot. Look at that. Look at that. Don't that look good? Oh, my God. That's going to be some good eatings today. Yeah. And what I'm going to do before I actually, before I actually uh, finish here, I'm going to make sure it's got enough salt in it. Get a fork. Sorry. I'm going to get a fork. And here we go. I'm going to make sure I got enough salt in it. You got to have enough. Well, thank you, Joy. Thank you. Let's see. This is my my money shot. Now interesting, but not interesting in being there. <laughs> now you know them kids. Now, I think it needs, I personally think it needs a little more salt. But if Sharita was here, thank you, Sharita. I think it needs a little more salt, Sharita. But I, I think you'd say don't put no more salt in there. That's what I think you say. But I think it do need a little more salt. Oh, it's good. Mm. It's really good. Don't do it. <laughs> I could taste a pinch more salt. I think it needs a pinch of just a little bit more salt. Ah, I can't take you with me. Hold on. I'm going to put you down. Unless you look over there. And put oh, some pepper in here. I'm gonna put a little pepper in here, a little bit of red onion in here. And okay, I'm gonna add just a little bit of pepper, extra pepper, first. You're gonna do that first. Let me take you up. Let me take you up. I think I can. Yeah, there we go. It's a little bit better. Maybe people, but maybe pepper, but not salt. Let's keep it healthy. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm trying, but we're going to put pepper in first. And I'm going to throw in a little bit of, a little bit of red onion powder ex extra. Because it definitely... You know, the other one was much, 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 to me, the other one was too much salt. So, you know, we don't want all that salt. We really don't. And I didn't, I do have this all in all, all in one. 
too. And if, after I stir this up, let me see if it needs more salt. I really should go find Perry because he'll tell me what he thinks. And oh, I'm gonna turn this off because we don't need this no more. I'm gonna turn it off. And see, the chicken got totally done anyway because it went back in and under pressure for six minutes. So it's done, you know, what's all in one. All in one is a Spain spice. And it got all kinds of, of flavoring, all kinds of, of other uh, spices in here. Actually, got paprika, uh, garlic, uh, granulated garlic, granulated onion, salt, coarse black pepper, basil, parsley, oregano, cumin, and dry mustard, which would be nice in here. And how much salt does it have? 70 milligrams. Really? That's good. That's easy. I think I will put a little of that in. It doesn't have... That's the reason I like this. That's why I always like Spain Spice. Because Spain Spice does not have that much salt in it. So I'm going to put a little. Just a little. Before I even tasted it. But just a little. Because Spain Spice really doesn't have... Just a pinch of that. Yes. That put a, I put a pinch in. I put a pinch in. I did just a pinch. I didn't put too much. And now, let me give it a taste. Let me give it another taste. I'm going to take it up again so you can see. Give this another taste. Uh, I, got most, I got mostly chicken right there. That's chicken. Mm -hmm. That's definitely a little better. Definitely a little better. And to be honest, mail you some. <laughs> All right, I may do just that. But to be honest, to be honest, this will be better tomorrow. This will be a lot better tomorrow. Mm. I'm hungry. I only had some toast all day. So I'm kind of hungry. All right, guys. 77 minutes on. Hmm, that's pretty good. Thank you guys that hung out with me. Thank you guys who's gonna watch me. And hold up. Let me look, let me let you look at me. I gotta use this. That's what it's there for. We just had lobster. Mmm. Which kind? You went do y'all went to the, that truck and had lobster? That um the truck you usually go to? Because actually they have that that truck comes out here too, by the way. I seen the truck. I forgot the name of that truck, but with the lobster roll. That's a good, that's also, what's the name of that truck, Sharita? If you're there, I know you're there. But I forgot the name of that truck. But yeah, that truck comes out here too. And lobster is, mm, lobster is delicious. Oh, you went to Sangria 71. Where is that? Is that in Long Beach? <laughs> oh, Cousins Lobster, that's right. That was it. That's it. They out here. They come out here. They, the truck comes here. I saw that on, um, I think on Facebook. I think I saw them. But they come out here to Dover Mall. So maybe I can eat that. And I would love to eat that. But Sharita Perry can't eat that. But lobster is delicious. Just as long as you know how much sodium you got in that. That's all. So, <coughs> excuse me. There's a prefix in Ireland near King Cullen. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I know on the island near King Cullen. Gotcha. Yeah. Which King Cullen? There's one in Valley Stream and there's one on Peninsula Boulevard. And then there's one way on the island too. So I know my I know where my grocery stores are in New York. I don't know where these places are out here. I even found some more Boar's Head, a place that you can get Boar's Head Deli. That's not too far, and I may go there. But I'm even, I'm trying to cut a little with the deli stuff, you know. Trying to do it. I'm trying to do it right. I'm trying to do right, cause I need to do right. But excuse me, I need to eat something. It's uh, I've been on like just about 80 minutes. Island Park. Oh, okay. Uh, have a great weekend too, Joy. We'll see you in like two weeks. Yep. I'm going to try to get back here in two weeks. I got to keep doing what I'm supposed to do. And I'm going to, you guys are going to keep me on schedule. <laughs> so I'm trying, I'm trying. Everybody have a great, great week. Have a great time. Um, if there's something that's negative, 
find the positive in it and make it good, okay? Try to make things good. Take that negative and turn it to a positive, okay? And you have three Super Bowl. I have three Super Bowl bikes. Bikes are part of boxes. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> so, I, like I said, people going to do the Super Bowl next week, which is quite fine. Have a good time. I hope your team wins. And uh, I'll be talking to you all later. Bye-bye.